Bismillah Rahman Rahim. We'll see the remaining slides. Okay. Today we are going to talk about the potential issues of international projects. Potential issues of international, potential issues of international projects. So very important. So it talks about good communication. Good communication. So it is the uh, line of command. It's a line of command. Yes, it's a line of command. Good communication from top management to the bottom. Yes. Then uh, it should be very smooth. Yeah. Then culture and custom. Culture and custom differences. So what is culture? Culture and custom provides important social and economic. It provides social and economic benefits. It provides economic benefits and also with improved uh, learning, the health increases also. It increases tolerances, opportunities to come together uh, with the other cultures. So culture enhances, culture enhances quality of life. Quality of life and also increases overall well-being for both individuals and communities for individuals and communities yeah then legal uh, project legal and political differences so it is like it legal actually it is like a project it's an application concept in project management to control the legal issues like for example related to laws all these legal issues then like uh, risk management risk issues risk management cost and also, like uh, it talks about the how about the past and present, past and present issues, then everything. So it talks about the risk issues and threatening issues, threatening life-threatening, life-threatening issues. So they should be taken into consideration. And politically, it should not as a political difference. Actually, the legal should not, uh, the law should not uh, combine with politics. So it should be it's different. So, political issue. It talks about the leadership, leadership, how the leader, how the leader manages the team. It talks about his governance power, how he controls the team, etc. So, they should follow the law. Political issues. They should follow the law. Yes. Then labor skills and experiences. Labor skills. So they should have a sound, technically strong. Technically, they should be strong. Then experiences, they should have good, uh, I mean, uh, idea to work, idea to work freely. Then next one is, it talks about environment. When you say about environment and infrastructure, it should be free from pollution. That is very, very important. Nowadays, always they go for the sustainability. So sustainability is a boring topic nowadays, so free from pollution free from pollution so the environment should be so designed uh, the environment has should be have good infrastructure that it should not affect the uh, community as well as it should not pollute the uh, society and environment so infrastructure should be well built well built well built yes then availability and availability of tools and controls so availability of tools and controls like should have good machinery then materials uh, high quality high quality to meet the customer needs okay next communication issues of uh, international projects communication issues of international projects like uh, we have uh, spoken uh, spoken language so very important spoken language then translation accuracy and con and contracts so spoken language is actually what is it actually it is like how the way the local language local language local uh, uh, local language local language spoken language then translation accuracy translation like for example when you want to convey convey proper message convey convey properly convey properly so it, is, it, it works behind the scene. It actually works behind the scene to be specific, have a specific parameters of project with high. It should be with high precision and accuracy. It should have high precision and accuracy because it actually translates the original one. Contracts. It is a, it's a exchange of legal. It's exchange of legal requirements or legal bonds, legal requirements between between parties. Okay, then we have uh, many body languages like gestures. You have gestures. 
or a language like should have good communication issues see in international projects so good gestures then greeting impressions what is gesture gestures the way of welcoming the way of welcoming way of welcoming the customers or welcoming way of welcoming welcoming way of welcome then greetings also like so this body language is greeting like like you put you salute something you you shake hand you shake hand etc then greetings uh, with smile smile on face smile on face yeah then impressions uh, that is that is you always uh, in a good manner giving respect giving respect so it always creates a good impression on the customers or uh, to the person who you are talking to then also it talks about like uh, measurements and units measurements and units it is dimensions measurements and units are dimensions or measure either it is like for example this length like length breadth length breadth then you have uh, feet meters centimeters etc then time zone you know time zone time differences in some in every every in the world is earth each and every part of the world has time differences like 2 hours to 3 hours it, it depends even the to, to a one day it is has one day one day okay 2 hours 3 hours one day 24 hours etc then information security information security is basically a practice of preventing unauthorized is a practice it's a practice of practice of preventing unauthorized is a practice of preventing unauthorized unauthorized access and the, for example also to modify inspect record the information and information can be physical or even electrical one so it is practice of preventing unauthorized access it might be of inspection or recording everything inspection recording recording etc either it is a physical one either it is a physical one or it might be a electrical one except then custom culture custom culture custom issues of international projects so we have uh, various uh, three i mean four uh, types of uh, custom culture issues like work ethics and motivation formality uh, work time and off time worker outplacement so here we can see work ethics work ethics is mainly talks about your view towards the view towards work and also improve specification so work ethic is a moral principle that the employee uses it is a moral principle it is a moral principle the employee uses and it is like a moral principle of employee in his job in his or her job okay it encompasses many of these traits like it uh, like based on like uh, dependability dedication dedication productivity then cooperation a good character etc then we have next one is uh, towards a foreign towards uh, work towards the uh, foreign companies so work towards for foreign companies like uh, should have international brands international international brands working in international companies with international brands so how is your work what is the way you practice while working with the those international brands then next is formality formality is like when you greet someone like uh, when you greet first time someone you wish them wish with respect wish with respect yeah regular interface interface should be there like good connection regular interface is a connection between good connection good connection between two parties good connection between two parties two people two groups with context to the working uh, uh, working towards a common or agreed upon a goal or completion of a project towards the goal then gift giving so it's exchange of it's exchange of love gift is actually exchange of love okay then attitude towards age so giving respect to the elderly 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 respect yes then social behavior how you behave in a society how you behave in behave in society it's very important 
then next you have work time and off time work time is holidays means work time sometimes your holidays means it's off it's off weekend sometimes it's off then vacation is off so these are all are of holidays okay then after our social and on call etc so these are all like working hours working hours that is uh, work working hours um, i mean uh, all the other leave leave on non, non working hours then worker outplacement what do you mean by outplacement worker outplacement actually it is a service that assists the departing employees if I, uh, it is a service to the employee it is a service to the employee departing employee leaving your company with obtaining uh, i mean employee with obtaining a new job or transitioning to a new career so to giving him to a new job give him access him to a new job and uh, the this outplacement service is offered by some employers as an employee benefit to the staff so as an employee benefit as an employee benefit so he can earn some money even after us uh, going from the company then you have legal political issues of international projects legal and political issues legal and political issues in international projects so what are the legal issues what are the politics what is the role of politics in this so legally i mean laws laws are written laws so you should be follow them you should not break the laws follow them perfectly then enforce laws enforce laws enforce laws means actually it is a it's a crime which is illegal so it's a crime it is a crime which is illegal and but it is not actually uh, penalized by juris jurisdiction but also it is a law which is usually ignored by law enforcement therefore such laws has no conse consequences but it is considered as illegal so you should take care then you have unreturned rights and entitlement unreturned rights unreturned rights and entitlements unreturned rights is also uh, like uh, mouth to mouth laws okay, but it is the uh, tradition like tradition this is like a tradition it follow them then uh, entitlements what is entitlement entitlements is a legal rights conveyed by the approvals from government entities to develop a uh, property for certain use intensity building type or building uh, placement like it is actually uh, to develop a property for use like actually it's like renting actually like renting or actually like renting it is for the certain use by given by the government given by the government for use for certain period for certain period okay then courts and uh, legislation courts and legislation. courts you know courts there here you give all the judgment decisions all the judgment decisions all the judgment decisions are given in the court then you have legislation legislation is actually the process of taking it is a process of taking process of taking legal action process of taking legal action yes this is legislation then you have politics is political stability so stability is that actually it is like uh, it affects the investor and i mean uh, the consumer confidence thus having a wider impact on it has a uh, wider impact on economy it has a wider impact on economy because because it affects the investors and cost consumer confidence that is why that is why it should have a political stability should be there because it affects a very bad effect on the economy affects the uh, consumer confidence so should keep uh, care keep a check on this then corruption 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 is you should be uh, uh, a society should be free from free from bribes okay bribe and uh, it will actually it will it will spoil the work it will the spoil the environment spoil the work environment okay then political system key influence people key influencing people and networks political system key influencing people and networks so political leaders political leaders leaders political leaders they have a parties network is they are party members party members okay then actually it is uh, they have the certain principles they have certain principles they have the principles of their party and they are following those principles to govern the society or to lead the society then we have uh, products 
I mean, situations that impact the project, like government overthrow, radical political uh, reform, then military actions, labor strikes. So all these things are very, very important to be taken into consideration when you have to be a stable government. And if there is a problem in the government, then government is not uh, having a proper majority, then they overthrow the government. Then they, they have radical uh, political reform. So at that time, president rule comes, there is military actions and labor strikes. So all this creates some sort of chaos, uh, panic in the environment.